Hi everybody! It's Maria here today. Today we're gonna have fun playing our、um, animal sound game. Before we start, I want to show you something that I forgot to tell you about last week. When you plant your seeds,、uh, there's something very important that I forgot to tell you about. Can you see what's down here? Can you see that there's some little holes under this container? It's very important that you have some holes underneath the vase, or you can use anything really to plant your flat your seeds. You could use like an egg carton, you could use a yogurt container, any kind of con little container you have at home. But it's very important that you make a hole underneath because the water has to drain. The water can't sit up here; it has to it has to come out because the the、um, Dirt has to be a little bit wet. It, has, it can be soaked. If it's soaked, the、um, seeds will run. It won't. It won't. It won't work. Okay. So be careful. Don't forget to do that. Quando plantas, quando plantas de tu, si tu plantas tu semilla, yo me olvidé de decir que es muy importante que tiene un agujero abajo del vaso para que la el agua no Algo tiene que salir, no puede se quedar aquí. Si se queda aquí, la semilla va a estar um, uh, mala, no va a no va a germinar. Okay. So these are ready. The, these are like this one. This tall one is ready to go outside. So if you decide to plant it outside, you could、um, take it out carefully and then plant it、um, in the ground. So maybe I'm gonna make you a video showing you how I do that. Um, how you can put it on the ground? If you don't, if you can't put it outside, you can keep it in a big container. Okay.、Um, I wanted to show you too. I got some pictures from some friends, and I was, I was I made me very happy.、Uh, I have a picture from Michael. Can you guys see? I'm not sure if you can see. There it is. See? Do you see Michael? The light is kind of. Hitting the, in a funny way. There he is. Do you see what? Do you, what do you notice about him? Something is different. Do you see what he's wearing now? Ah,、oh, he's wearing glasses just like me. And who else wears glasses in our class? Presley, Ariella.、Uh, he looks so handsome. I love. I love getting that photo. And I also got. Photos from、um, Tiago. Tiago、uh, sent me pictures of his last letter sorting. See, he's doing the cutting and sorting of the letters. And then、uh, I'm very excited because he is up. He is doing、uh, some plants too. He planted some.、Um, He planted some、uh, some onion, and then he drew the steps of the plant growing. And he's he's here's what he planted. He's plant he planted some onions. Can you see his plants in the ground? Tiago plantó cebollas. Mmm, me gusta cebollas mucho. Mmm, delicioso. Gracias, Tiago. Me gusta mucho su trabajo. Okay. So let's start today our letter play. Can you see my letter here? Okay. We're gonna pretend to be an earthworm. So can you take your little finger? Imagine que tú eres un lombriz. Any inchworm inches along, chomps and chomps all day long. Sounds like this: a for inchworm, and it looks like that. Okay, next we're going to do um 
Whoops. This ladder here. You know this ladder? Yeah. Gonna now we're gonna pretend to be a zebra. Okay, imagine that you imagine that you are a zebra who is sleeping. The zebra is asleep. A sleeping zebra. Make a little pillow. Zeki zebra takes his these. Do not wake him if you please. Sounds like this. And it looks like that. Can you make that sound with me? I said, sonido conmigo, conmigo. All right, now we're going to make a penguin. So this, for this one, we have to stand up. So stand up, and then you're going to put your feet apart like this, your legs apart, and your, your uh, hands are by your side like this coming out. Then you, can you see my feet? My feet have to be kind of, kind of ballerina feet, and then my hands are going to be by my side like that. And we're gonna be, pretend to be a penguin. Imagine que tú eres un pingüino. Peewee penguin does the penguin walk. Wraps a long and perfect penguin talk. Sounds like this. And it looks like that. Did you do it with me? Alright. Now, we're going to do a little bit of writing. So, see if you can look in your packet and look for the, this sheet of paper, okay? Okay. Okay, so we're going to start by doing the letter I. Okay, letter I, which makes the it sound. Let's start here. So I start here on top, and then I'm going to go this way to make a long line. Then I go back to the middle and go down. Now back here and make another line. So that's my uppercase I for inchworm. And now I'm going to do a line like this, and a little dot. That makes the uh, the uh, lowercase, right? Okay, so that was letter I. It's a bit tricky, but you can do it. So right here in this spot is where you could you could try to write your I. Here we go. I'm going to show you one more time. One line. Another line standing up, and then one line laying down on the bottom. And that makes the uppercase I. Now I'm going to do lowercase, one little line and a dot. Now let's try doing the letter P. So I'm going to do a big P first, starting up on top again. Make a long line going down. And then I'm going to make like a belly like this, like a curve. There it is. And now for the lowercase p, the little one, I make one long line and a curve too. And that's, this is the one I used to write a name. This is the one that I used to write a word. Or I use it in the middle of the name. Now we're gonna do the last one. Try here doing P on the on your on this spot, and then we're gonna try Z now. Z for Z, zebra. This is gonna be a tricky ladder, but we can do it. So we're gonna start here. We're gonna go this way. Then we're gonna go sideways that way. Whee! All right. Now I'm gonna be coming back this way. All right. It's kind of like a zigzag. Look this way. And that's the big Z. And now what, the little Z is the same, just smaller. Okay.
That's a tricky one, but you can do it. Just practice. You can do it. Now, I wonder if my friends can help me think of some friends in our class that start with the, these letters. Do we have any, anybody in our class that start with the letter I? Any friends in our class? Start with that letter, the A. You don't, right? I don't think there's anybody in our class that start with that letter. A lot of us might have this letter in your name, like I have it in my name, Marie, E, E, Leah. But nobody starts with that letter. Nadie in nuestra class empieza con esta letra. Okay, now, how about P? Do we have anybody in our class that start with P? ¿Quién en nuestra clase tiene esta primera letra, este primero sonido en su nombre? Let's see. Ooh. How about Joseph? What? Joseph doesn't start with P? You're right. Silly me. No, Joseph doesn't start with P. Joseph starts with J, right? J, J. Okay. Oh, I know. Presley. Presley starts with P. She was our birthday girl. She had a birthday last week. And there's somebody else who's also having a birthday. This girl is having a birthday tomorrow. It's Paola. Paola starts with P. So, alright. I think that's it for P in our class. Yeah, Paola Presley. How about um, Z? Alright, I think... Um, Dylan. Dylan starts with Z. What? Dylan doesn't start with Z? You're right. I made a mistake. Dylan doesn't start with Z. What? Zara starts with Z? You're right. Okay, Zara. Zara. Oh. Zara has an H, then an R. Z A H R A. Zara starts with Z. Is there anybody else? No, that's it. So, we have zero friends that start with I or for inchworm. Then we have two friends that start with P. And then we have one friend that starts with Z. Very nice. All right. What I need you to do, guys, is to find this paper here. This is the paper that we're going to use for our sorting activity. So, what you can do now is you can color it, and then we're going to cut right on that line. Do you see where the black line is? So, you're going to start cutting right here, okay? And then you got to cut, you got to cut all the way up to here, and then you got to cut here, so you have all your, your, um, Squares ready, your rectangles ready to do sorting. Entonces ahora busqué este paquete, en tu paquete este, este papel y vamos a colorir y después cortar en la línea. Ok? Alright, so, um, while you, while you guys do that, let's take a look around our house. Can we find some some something in our house? 
with the, those letters, the letter I, P, or Z. Let's see. Let's take a look around. Oh, look at this. I found in this picture, I found one letter. Do you see the letter that I'm talking about that we learned today? Mira esta foto. You see this one? It's a P for pontalier. Pa, 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 pa. Hmm. What else could I find with the letter, with my letters? Ah, uh, look, this is the letter I. Oop, this way. Letter I sometimes looks like that. Sometimes it doesn't have the dot. It should have a dot or it should have the lines underneath. But this is I for k I -ch -an. I -I. And look, right here. It. You will it eat it. It. That's another letter I. So we found P, we found I. Can hmm. I help too? Sure. Can you help us find the letter Z? Yes. Maybe in here on the on the hmm. fridge. Can we find no. Z anywhere? Okay. Z is a tricky letter to find. Oh. There. Ooh, yeah, the pretzels. I need find. a little super Can you guys find the Z here? Look. Okay. Oops. Z, z, z. There's the Z. Guys, let me do something that's really good plan. Okay. Full stop. Rolling. Well, what we need to do now is we need to, um, you guys at Back home. up the plan. Back up the plan. Okay, back up the plan. Liam, the boys and girls at home, they're going to go color this picture. Can you help me color this picture? And then we're going to cut it. To get it okay. ready for our sorting. Now, now. to find the letter T. Ahora, tú puedes uh, colorir y cortar y vamos a regresar para, ir, um, para terminar. We're going to come back and finish our, our letter activities, okay? Mom! Busca en tu casa las letras. 